Hey guys, it's XAMK Epic here, and welcome to my Black Ops 4 weapon guide. Today, we'll be covering the Ballistic Knife. Making its fourth incarnation, the Ballistic Knife is the only special weapon in the game to date, and is unlocked through the microtransaction system. Backed by popular demand, the Ballistic Knife has had previous forms in the latter Black Ops games. What makes the Ballistic Knife so unique to all its predecessors is that the Ballistic Knife can shoot a deadly blade as well as melee a close range opponent. These blades can be retrieved once fired by simply walking over the blades. In game, damage is high with a fired blade or melee attempt resulting in a one hit kill to any opponent. What makes this Ballistic Knife unique from prior models is that the Ballistic Knife has zero drop, meaning that aiming at your target from any distance will not require you to aim any higher than usual. This is good as it leads to more precise shots, but unique cross maps such as arcing straight overs or as high as you can shots are ineffective. Another new trait is that your ballistic knives must now be reloaded manually into the weapon. Rate of fire for the ballistic knife comes at 49 blades per minute. Reload time is quick at a staggering 1.21 seconds. Standard magazine is two blades similar to the Black Ops 1 version. Finally, the time to melee is 0.06 seconds given you connect with your intended target. This ballistic knife represent also boasts a handful of attachments to improve your weapon's overall ability, in order to keep up with Black Ops 4's fast paced game modes. First up is extra blades, granting 4 blades overall as opposed to the usual 2. Having a few extra blades can ensure that unretrieved blades will not be your downfall. Next, fast reload will allow you to recharge blades quicker than waiting for the blade insertion. Quick reload time is 0.58 seconds, a whole 23 seconds faster than the standard reload time. The third available attachment is gas powered. This makes time to kill the ballistic knife over any range instant. Over a long range, time to kill is 0.35 seconds, but the gas powered blade takes it down to 0.06 seconds. This firepower is so quick, spectres won't have time to aim their katanas before a blade goes through the back of their mind. Finally, the operator mod is a dual wielding ballistic knife. These dual wield blades take your firepower up to 98 blades per minute, along with allowing you to re-aim if you should miss your target the first time round. It must be known that the dual wield blades and extra blades cannot be equipped at the same time. However, Crash's ammo pack and the perk scavenger allow you to increase your blade supply ensuring you never run out. For our ballistic knife class we'll be utilising speed, stealth and surprise. Our first attachment is the fast reload. This attachment grants us access to quicker blade insertion, giving us an upper hand against multiple enemies. Next up, the gas reload attachment helps against far to reach enemies, teaching them how instant death can be. Finally, the dual wield operator mod will allow us to have double the firepower amongst enemies. For our perks, scavenger is a must, each pack adding one additional blade to our collection. Lightweight is a good second choice granting us quick flank speed as well as allowing us to get up close and personal with our enemies. Our final perk is Ghost. This perk will keep you off the map until you get caught in a fog of war or shoot a blade towards an enemy. For your final selection, a concussion Vone newbie can halt the enemy firepower whilst you run in for the kill. And that's our loadout. A run and blade setup with quick up and close battles whilst catering to the Ballistic Knife's long range traits. Ballistic Knife is one of a kind with a legacy to challenge any weapon. Range is not an issue, meaning enemies from close and far are targets. Stick to the shadows, and when the time's right, go ballistic. Thanks for watching guys, leave a like if you have enjoyed, if you haven't seen my S6 Stingray weapon guide already, check it out, I uploaded it a few days ago. Also, I'll be covering the Vendetta sniper rifle next, along with the Locust shortly to come. If you're new to my channel, please do subscribe, it'll really help me out, and keep the notifications on to know next time I upload. Thanks for watching and stay epic.